everybody, and welcome to MTU Esports. Today, our MTU Huskies Rocket League varsity team is taking on St. Xavier University in the NACE Varsity Premier League. Uh, I'm Jevin Glick, uh, no. gamertag Azlef900. I'm Isaac, also known as Isaac. Today, we got MTU. Uh, our players for MTU are Tyler Tater, Isaac Stewie, Lucas Grape, and Hans Galaxy Guy. Yep, and over at uh, St. Xavier, we have Toast, Gruesome Orc, I Am DJ6, uh, Z-Ball, and Kelvin. Two eyes. Yeah, nice little little two eye. We got uh, tonight, the Varsity Rocket League team ends the regular season on a double header. The Huskies are currently 4-1 and one and sitting in third place in the conference. The Cougars are 4-2 and two and in fourth place. The top seed gets an instant spot in the national playoffs, while second and third have to play through the last chance qualifiers. This game is win and in to the LCQs for the Huskies, and if they beat St. Clair, they'll be conference champions. If MTU can't win this one, they'll have to beat St. Clair, and Lou Bach Christian will have to lose both of their games to make it into the LCQs. This game is huge for the Huskies, so root hard for them in this series. Let's go Huskies. Let's do it. Oh, my God. Okay, yep. Um, it looks like the game is starting. That worked out well. Sometimes you got to cut to it. And here is our Huskies in blue and St. Xavier in orange here. <laughs> He's almost said green. I almost said green. I almost said red. <laughs> it's, always, it's always blue and orange. Always blue and orange. Never change. Uh, we got Tater up in the corner looking for some offense here. St. Xavier doing a great job just trying to control that ball and keep it in the corner away from that MTU offense that we know Stewie and Tater. Oh, oh, Galaxy, Galaxy guy. guy already scoring. I think this is the first time we've seen him on stream so far this semester. Yes, like, I believe I believe so. And he just starts off this game with a bang wow. into that bottom left corner. Yep. So I, I think the way it works is like Rocket League is very much a game about like uh, team synergy. Um, and it's it's Stewie and Tater that have like the synergy. And who, who, who's, 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 who else is in our is in our cast? Great, great. great. Is great. The, uh, the other, he's usually in here, but they have Galaxy Guy in it. Obviously, he's paying off a little bit here. I think I think Grape and Galaxy Guy are a little bit newer, so it's like getting that synergy going. Uh, a team game like Rocket League is super super important. Absolutely. Uh, I, Grape was in last year. He didn't he didn't have too much of a uh, performing role up in like the game, but and then I know Galaxy Guy is new this year. So. Oh, a little demo there uh, from Tater. Yeah, looks like Galaxy Guy trying to look for another shot and goal here, looking with Stewie while Tater was still respawning there. Huskies up to an early lead, so hopefully they can just try to get some more on the board. Or oh, the nice little aerial oh. here, so clean with the assist from oh. Stewie, but Orc does block the shot Galaxy here. Guy going back up for another one, and ah, there it is! It. Two Galaxy Guy, my him. goat. Yeah, for real. That was a clean play. He, he just saw here that. on the ropes. Yeah, he saw that read and he just he was just like, I got it. It's all me. Little dribble, little dribble in the goal, a bounce. Yeah. Hot take Rocket League's more like basketball than soccer. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, you're not entirely wrong. Uh, I, I am I am entirely wrong. I don't know where you're coming from right now. Like like the dunking and all that kind of thing. There's a there's a basketball mode, but it's kinda mid in my opinion. Anyways, yeah, uh, yep. Stewie, Stewie and uh, Tater looking for some early offense yet again. St. Xavier's just can't seem to answer this offense. They, I don't think they've got a, a single shot on target yet. We're talking about the offense. I'm talking about the double rainbow all the way. You can see the screen <laughs> up there. <laughs> Galaxy guy and Tater going up again. Those two have just been relentless. Quarterly. Usually we see Stewie and Tater just taking that offense and running with it with Grape a little bit farther back, but it looks like the, the roles are a little changed with Galaxy Guy in. Yeah, kind of a sticky situation right here. Um, St. Xavier getting it out of the, their side of the field, uh, pushing it towards MTU's goal here. But it gets in that dreaded corner. Oh, a Tater with a great save. A shot from Org. Galaxy Guy oh, coming back great. in with another yep. save. Yep, goaded save, getting it sent across the field here. Tater looking, looking to Tater capitalize with the on their, their a little too aggressive offense there. Yeah, just push it in the corner, play it safe. Absolutely. You know, uh, handle control the ball, right? A great, great challenge by oh, Galaxy Guy there. Score. I, I can't. I, I missed it. Who? Uh, 
Who missed the save here? I guess we'll see it in the instant replay. It was, a, it was a great challenge from Galaxy Guy, and then Tater just barely missing that. Stewie. Toast got a, yeah. a last second touch to get that ball right past him. Didn't quite get the jump there. Oh my god, the phantom dabs. 222, <laughs> angel number on the clock. MTU still up, 2 1. Stewie looking for some quick offense. We've ah! seen, we've oh seen him do it, it was again quick and offense. again. It was okay. 217 on the clock. <laughs> a little five second goal there. Those really add up too, because I mean, a quick five second goal. I mean, I've seen it go for like three, four minutes. Oh, a little, little drop. Uh, three, four minutes with like, you know, like it's kind of like hockey where like no one really scores. You know? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Uh, Stewie always seems to find those. Or they kind of they kind of just like did the same exact thing. And they just thing responded. And flexed on us a little bit harder with the three seconds to the five. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, all right, uh, we got we got to get one of those two. Uh, let me let me think real quick here. All right, I guess like not not two to one anymore. Three to two. MT still up one point. Tater looking for another kickoff goal here, but not seeming to find it right away. Still getting it back in the center there. That Saint Xavier not looking too like offensively dominant this this match. It's it's been all MTU, and then Saint Xavier's had like two really good pushes. It Ooh, looks goal like here. Uh, Tater with the great save, getting it out of uh, MTU's, MTU's goal. I gotta learn some more like soccer terminology here. <laughs> I just want to say goal. MTU's side goal of the box. field, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah Saint Xavier just trying to keep up that Sending offense. it across the field, gonna uh, catch the lip of the goal here. Work going up for. Work with the nice the aerial, little... getting a pop in the corner. Toast, Toast sending it across shot. the field. Tater there with the save. He's taking control. He's he's looking for that that cross map uh, shot again. Galaxy's Galaxy guy been pushing all it towards the over this this offense. He's just been every every step of the way there. Tater, Tater hitting up. it out of the air, not letting I don't, I don't know, Toast, not letting Toast get the follow up here. Stewie, Stewie, Stewie. With, oh, Stewie gets the demo. Almost had the goal. Saint Xavier going for it all right here. Stewie's, Stewie. got, Stewie's back, responding in time to try to alleviate some of that offense. I, I think it hit the lip of the goal anyway. So oh, it absolutely it did. But that lip of the goal can be ah, really nasty. Guy. Get it out of there. Ooh, he's getting past two defenders. Come on, Stewie. Stewie hitting it for three. With he's the looking lob. for the double tap. Oh, 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 that's not a little drop. Stewie and Galaxy Guy just cooking up that St. Xavier defense. Unfortunately, basically, like, right now, it's like, play the long game. You want to keep the offensive pressure up. Don't let the, uh, you know, enemy team get too cocky here. But when you're up two points... Uh, in a game that's going a little bit slower, right? Besides, like those one goals that were back to back. Absolutely. Um, you know, just keep just keep the lead, right? I'm, I really like Galaxy guys' detail, decal. It's a it's a I've never seen it before, but it's it's really cool. I like the little like it looks like venom almost. Uh, Stewie and Tater trying to cook up some more offense. Or going for a shot but just missing. Yeah. Tater, Tater just getting it out that of there, the putting in the corner for another 30 seconds. They don't. They don't have to score. They just got to hold on for 20 more seconds here. Exactly. Saint Xavier all over that offense, just trying to get shot after shot in. Yep. And yep. They're really putting something there, but they weren't ready for the disruption. And MTU's just all over it. They're they're just absolutely not allowing any shenanigans here. And it's like yeah, get in the corner. That's cool. Tater, Warp, Tater, Tater walk ah! one. Oh, oh my God! I was like, am I gonna? Are you gonna get the assist? Am I gonna get the assist here? We definitely have it. No one's coming to stop us. I look think, at this I is think so cute. Look at this. Look at this. He's like, ah, do you want like, it? They like. They like. Yeah, just like, you can have a nice it. Nice little <laughs> pass. Like a little roll. Oh, so cute with one second on the clock <laughs> too. So that's wraps for this game. It's actually physically listen, not possible listen, for I Saint think, Xavier. I think. Don't don't count them out. Don't. Count them out. They could bring it back. Oh, yeah. Absolutely for the series, but no, no, MTU's they, got this. I meant this. for the game. They, they didn't bring it back. Oh, One no, second on the didn't. clock. They did not score three back-to-back three, -back goals. Three three-second goals? Little disappointing. I know, I know I cast for MTU, and I got to root for MTU, but I, I seriously thought St. Xavier had it there. Yeah. Uh... Oh. Uh, it's, it's great. It's great. Like, they... Everybody played well there. MTU just keeping that offense up. St. Xavier wasn't able to, to replicate just as well. Um, and it looks like we're going back into another match here in just a second. Yeah, and uh, real quick, if you're a tech, uh, tech student, uh, you'd be close to campus. We have places for that. Uh, find the perfect location. Live where you want to live at HoughtonForRent.com. All right, back to game number two here. MTU pretty convincing lead, 
Not, nah, that was kind of scary, I'm not going to yeah, lie. Yeah, absolutely. That was a, a great kickoff from Zayn Xavier, but Stewie just taking that ball and flipping the map for MTU. If you're new to the stream, you don't know how bad, like, the puns were when we had great. <laughs> so, yeah, because great is just such, like, the perfect, like, he just He just makes great plays, League. you know? Yeah, it's like, yeah, it was a grape save. Yeah, it yeah. It was a grape shot, and, like, no <laughs> one would laugh, and we'd make... We just like beat the dead horse. So I, I think it's. I still think it's funny. But no, I, I, nobody, do, I do too. So I, I got over myself. I think this. Like you can say the same joke over and over and over and over again, and it's still be funny sometimes. Absolutely. I, I think it's funny. I think it's funny. But some people, some people not so much. Tater going for a little flip reset shot there. Not quite finding what he was looking for. Stewie going up, trying to take control yeah, of this ball, get it out here. of mid. Oh, a nice pass to Tater. I didn't even These see. These aerials him. so clean, putting in the corner, getting the boost. Do we going for a little center here, it looks like. Galaxy guy trying to follow up, centering it himself. Tater going for a shot. Ooh. All right, pretty clean here. MT has good control of the Ooh. ball right now, bouncing it over, Orc's head. Nice little flick, Stewie Put. going up. The, the MTU, it's been all over like the San Xavier side of the field. Like obviously it's not right now. The MTU. The MTU. The MTU, something like a Russian guy or something. <laughs> the MTU. <laughs> <laughs> Stewie going up for a challenge, taking that ball away from St. Xavier's possession right there. Minute and a half in, uh, still no goals either side of the field here. MTU has been looking, even no no goals, not a lot of points going on, but St. No Xavier goals. has been like just on the brink of breaking down from this MTU offense. On the brink of breaking bad. <laughs> Walter, Jesse! Oh, Galaxy Guy almost getting a nasty redirect into that St. Xavier net. Cute Tater demo looking for here. Some, some damage. Some damage control to try to get a, a goal in that. Tater, Tater! Get, going for some My demos. My guy, cooking it up own. here. Don't let St. Xavier score here. Absolutely. A little not. heated. Looks like they didn't capitalize. Either they had a really good defensive positioning or like uh, they failed to capitalize on that opening uh, as well as they could have there. Oh my god! Stewie! Beautiful pass. Little, little bounce. Little bounce. Came to him. Took his opportunity. Or thought he had it. Bop. Absolutely not. Stewie is so all clean. over that. So clean. Uh, over two minutes in. Uh, into to game number two here. MTU up 1-0. Yeah, don't don't get don't get those like five three second goals this game. It'll keep your lead. Uh, tapping it out of the air to Galaxy Guy, pushing it across the field here. Galaxy Guy trying to take possession back. Stewie taking for, taking his, his time, looking looking for a shot there, but not quite finding it. Saint Xavier has been nasty with these uh, demos. It's it's like one every like 20, 30 I don't, seconds. I don't understand like the the demo meta in Rocket League. I understand it's like a thing that happens, but I don't know how like how easy or desirable they are to get, or if you like should or want to be going for them, or if they just kind of happen. Yeah, so um, I'll try to I'll try to point it out the next time it happens. Um, when you go fast enough, you get like these little trail behind you. It should pop up right there. See that purple yep, trail? Yeah, it's like the the drift sparks Mario Kart. Yeah, yeah. So once you're you're going that speed and you bump into some, like you hit another uh, car that's on the other team, it'll actually blow them up, and that's that's what causes a demo. Okay. Yeah. Is that with your teammates too? Nope. Uh, if it's just your teammates, you'll just send them flying, and it's really annoying. A lot of a lot of people. Uh, it's it's a very point of contention. Some people get really toxic when you, you bump into them. They're not it's happy. Like, no, that. don't bump into me. You know <laughs> I don't like being bumped into. Yeah, yeah, exactly. MTU looking for some more shots on goal here. Oh, and cute little demo there, Xavier getting it out of the goal. Or trying to go for something, but Galaxy guy a great taking from it Galaxy from his guy. possession. Stewie and Tater in that corner looking for some some passing MTU play. MTU offensive like. pressure is heating there's up. Galaxy guy. Galaxy Stewie, guy. Stewie Galaxy Guy has been an un underrated duo in this game. Both, both of these games. Dynamic duo. Alright. MTU up 2-0 with 1-10 left in the game. St. Xavier has been unable to answer at all, really. I, I think they've only gotten... Yeah, four shots on goal to MTU's, to be fair, four shots, but the the goal ratio is obviously a little a little different. So, Galaxy guy looking a little bit up for a center here, maybe trying to get it towards Stewie or Tater. Yep, there's Stewie going in for another another center. Tater's there to try to control it, keep it on their side of the field. 
Toast looking looking for something, but MTU takes that ball away. They have been oh. holding onto these balls for as long as they can. Can you say that one more time? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tater, Tater looking for a nice little center there. Oh my God, Still the MTU it. offensive pressure is relentless. They're like, they're like, like wiping the sweat from their brows. So like, all right, guys, we did it. We got the ball out of the goal. Five seconds later, <laughs> bam. Yeah, Bob, exactly. Work not there. Toast not there. Stewie. It's, it's all him. Clean, a little clean with it. Saint Xavier has been looking a little uncomfortable in Stop. this match. Don't do it. Don't do it to him. <laughs> oh my God, he did it to him. It's 4-0. That's Saint nasty. Xavier. This is gonna be these. These games are best two out of threes, right? The, Absolutely. the matches. So this is uh, no, no, not no, three out of five. Three, three out, of five. out of five. I was like, I'm not okay. I play too much Smash Bros, brother. <laughs> too, much, too much Smash Brothers, brother. Yeah. So if they win this game and the next game, MTU 3-0 clean. Yep, clean 3-0. I mean, I I didn't hold it out for Zane Xavier on the back to back to back <laughs> one to one to one on the one second on the clock. But Galaxy uh, guy almost gets they can, a they can nasty always, shot. There's right five there. seconds on the clock. If they can score five goals, one it's goal. Possible. It's every it's possible. second. They can bring it back. I, I saw the vision. I saw the vision. He he just he was a, a millimeter am, off from hitting that nasty. I'm, I'm Doctor hit Strange. Goal. I've looked into seven million different possible futures. This was not one of the ones for Saint Xavier one, unfortunately. It's yeah, <laughs> Galaxy guy wanting another goal, but not quite getting it. Two zero. Winner. MTU. MTU. Galaxy Again. guy doing a little handstand there. The the Saint Xavier offense has has just not been there. Their defense has been fairly solid, considering how much pressure they're being put on. But their their offense, they're getting this game. They got four shots in. I feel like they're being forced to, to force, nine. forced to play defense while like they want to be playing offense, but they just can't get out of the defense uh, defensive. Uh, they can't get away from MTU's offensive pressure. Born to play defense or born to play offense. Forced, forced to, to play, play defense. defense. Uh, good stuff from uh, MTU here. Um, if you came to the stream late and you want to keep up with the rest of MTU Esports, uh, be sure to follow our Twitch channel if you want to see past VODs and other future content. Uh, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. Both tags are at MTU Esports. MTU E-S-P-O-R-T-S. We are going back into another game here. Game we three. Got, uh, back to back to back. 15 seconds in. Nothing has happened quite yet. There we go. Uh, Stewie looking for a little cross-field pressure. Or going up for some uh, was aerial, just, he was aerial shots, but he ran out of boost. Uh, what yes. were you doing, Toast? A little Dude. disheartened by the goals. Stewie, you know, capitalizing in every opportunity he can. Great teamwork for MTU here. That passing is pinpoint oh crazy. God. That, that like, drop on the splash is like, hmm, mm, so perfect. Absolutely. It's been it's been ridiculous. Like, here we go again. Another, another shot on goal for MTU. And Orc and the rest of Saint Xavier have been forced to. Oh, great fall back stuff to from defense. Tater, knowing exactly where to be. Taking uh, taking that ball possession away is huge. Galaxy guy, get it out of there! There, he's taking it. Gets he's it taking the center it and field. Going. Toast with the block, pushing it in the corner, getting it out of the goal. A lot of booze trying to get it in the air into MTU's goal. Tater taking it, trying to trying to set something up here. Maybe with Tater Stewie Tater taking it. <laughs> I, I don't know. It. The, the puns are even worse than they have been in our Rocket League series so far, Isaac. <laughs> Tater and I am DJ6 going for a challenge there. Not finding anything. <laughs> other the cute little demo there. It's so funny. It's like, oh. The pressure the pressure has been so much better for St. Xavier right here. But yeah, I would say it's been a little bit scarier, success. but MTU pushing it down the field! You can't be missing this. You can't it's be missing like, this. It's like, it's like once St. Xavier gets the offensive pressure up, their defensive pressure cracks. Exactly. And, you know, MTU yeah. gets it out of uh, out of their... Uh, God, I'm oh, so bad at it. It looked like... I, I didn't see that the first time. It looked like Stewie bumped Toast out of the way. Clean. A, a nice little Clean. defense nice, offense. Nice little uh, assist there from Stewie. You know, getting lost in translation. Absolutely. Catching it on the replay. MCU up 2-0. Minute and a half on the clock. Again, this is game three. Things are not looking hot for St. Xavier, but this is Ooh. a double header, so there will be. Um, oh my god! Oh, that, that, was a, that was a good, good play by St. Xavier, but they cannot find the net. I mean they found the net. There's some like quantum mechanics, like <laughs> the particles can be in two places at once or whatever. I'm kind of surprised <laughs> that didn't go in. 
It only it only appears when you look at it. Obviously, it. That, was, that was not happening. You know, all the MTU right there, it's like, yeah, bro, let it M happen. MTU observed it and said, mm mm. <laughs> Galaxy guy taking this, looking for a center. We're at, we're at tech school. We gotta we gotta put in some quantum nah, mechanics e, physics. E equals um, <laughs> MC squared. <laughs> Saint Xavier has been looking a little bit more dominant on the pressure, but definitely not the the goals. Like the I, I feel like the possession has been. Uh, I feel like flipped. in Rocket League, it's like as soon as they started playing hot, it's already you know halfway through game three. Yeah, absolutely. Like right. Don't count him out yet, though. Toe scoring first goal. MC still up. 2-1, uh, St. Xavier kind of getting a better read on MTU, uh, you know, being able to keep up the defensive pressure, put on some more heat, but MTU is ready to strike back, not getting too cocky. Absolutely. It looks like Stewie was just a piece behind there, otherwise he would have had that for sure. I, I think I think they're relaxed. They're, they're relaxing a little bit when they shouldn't be relaxing. Yeah. It's like, I would say in, in competitive esports, it's like you want to let your guard down, you cannot let your guard down ever. Cute little aerial demo there. And it looks like St. Ah! Xavier let their guard down too ah! much. Oh there's there's Stewie's crazy redirect from oh. the backfield. That was across the court. Across the map. A beautiful shot. 360 no scope. It was headshot. Bam. Would that, would that have gone in? I, it looked like it was going to hit the it, post. It looked like it was going in from my perspective, but I'm not. A, I'm not. A, I'm a Rocket League casual. There's a there's a good chance that would have that would have hit the post and not gone in if Saint Xavier wouldn't have touched it. But I, I think it'd be. I think. I think it, lo it looked like it was going in from from my eyes. But it I'm was. Also, it was I'm, also, I'm also not an expert. So. Definitely a close one. I'm not a, an expert either, but looks do, like Tater's do you, do you going up for another aerial. Ah! Trying to get. Do you have a thousand hours in Rocket Ooh. League? Oh, uh, I think if I don't, it's pretty close. I have like. Ten. I, I, probably, I, th I think that should be telling. I know I know I have a few hundred, but I, I don't know I don't know how many. That's fair. That's fair. Probably not a thousand. Oh, Galaxy Stewie! guys! So so that's that's the perfect example of a like a great demo right there. Yep, like okay. Stewie Stewie has a like a very slow, fairly slow for this game shot. Would have been blocked by that defender, but Galaxy guy just demos him right in the goal. Oh wow, it's such an interesting level of like. Okay, this is like hands-on learning. That, that, that makes a lot of sense about like the like the tactical use of demos and like wanting to uh, stay moving in Rocket League, which can be pretty chaotic too. Absolutely, yeah. It, it's it's a very punishing just to like sit in the goal like you did, just because of that that like threat. Yeah, exactly. Interesting stuff. Interesting stuff. I'm picking up more and more of this game. Uh, played at a higher top level, right? Uh, as, like, as we keep streaming and keep commenting. Galaxy, Galaxy guy! guy taking Saint this one Xavier, all things by are himself. looking rough. Uh, a, you're currently nice... on track to getting 3 0'd by MTU. Um, it looks like you had something with the offensive pressure here. But uh, I, they started out strong. I'll, I'll give it to them. They, were, they started out really strong. They got scored on fairly quickly, but like the pressure was definitely there. And the momentum has completely flipped my, back my, to MTU. My question now. Is, is like, why have we had. Galaxy guy in the reserve tank all semester so far. Yeah, like, yeah. Bro is bro is like pulling his weight and then some. Absolutely, like like great. Don't get me wrong, did great things. He, he does great things. He did, he did, he did he great did, work. He did what Everybody on this team is crazy talented. But oh my god, okay. That Galaxy was guy going close there. Again. It's like yeah, just play keep away. Forty five seconds on the clock. I was gonna say that's the thing with MTU here. It's like don't like don't let it get to your head. Don't let the lead get to your head. Absolutely. Um, you know, always, you know, until the, until you have one, like, you are still in this, um, you know, playing as, uh, with as much intensity as you, as you can bring to the table, right? Rocket League is a game where you can very easily flip Stop. from from any... Well, maybe, Brazil? maybe maybe not as much anymore, 6-1, less than 30 seconds on the clock. Br Brazil? Brazil. Oh, my God. I, I don't even know Brazil now. Let's do it. Let's go, Brazil. One, one more? One more MTU? One more. All right, now we're, we're rooting for like a different kind of victory. <laughs> it's like the 3 is kind of no, set in stone. No, no, Yes! Come what on. What a save. What a save. 15 keeping, seconds. Keeping, keeping 15 MTU seconds. in Brazil territory. All right, let's cook MTU. Seven to one. You got you it. Guys you guys got, got it. it. Beautiful center Believe from Tater. In Two yourself demos coming in. Believe in yourself. Stuck in the corner. Tater, Tater, Tater. 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 Okay, we missed the Brazil. So close. Just so close. barely, but we did win. MTU 3-0 over St. Xavier, but this is a double header. A beautiful so series from MTU. Beautiful series from MTU. So clean.
So yeah, it seems like it seems like uh, having Galaxy guy definitely is like he has more brings more offensive pressure to the team. Where Grape was like a very like solid I think, defensive I, anchor. I think I think Galaxy guy also has like maybe a little bit of a, a better team synergy as well, which is something that my mind doesn't work with super well because I play Smash Bros Ultimate right, and that's normally not a game that you play. Uh, doubles is uh, fun, casuals is fun, uh, but traditionally, archetypically, you play one v one. So there is not much of a team synergy there. Rocket League, on the other hand, I mean, you're really, really uh, working with your other two teammates, um, you know, trying to trying to synchronize, trying to get the same wavelength, the same, like, you know, telepathic tuning, right? Yeah, yeah. And it, it seems like, like in the in the few games that we, like, casted together, it was, uh, like, Grape had a great, absolutely fantastic passes to, like, Stewie and uh, Tater. And it seems like uh, it's more of like a back and forth with Galaxy Guy, if that makes sense. Absolutely, absolutely. Definitely, definitely an interesting like dynamic. It's great to have two like different kind of players in your roster just to like flip them, flip them out. Because yeah, they, they one, have... one, okay, we, we need our defensive anchor for this team yeah, to kind of look yeah. at their vods, check them out a little bit. Uh, this guy's like, let's just like foot on the. I don't, I don't know if there's guys in the cars in Rocket League, <laughs> but we're hitting the gas. Somehow, I don't think they answered that in the cars either. It's like, yeah, yeah, the, I, I, the machines are sentient. We have AI. I don't now, think so. there's Rocket League lore. I feel like that needs to be a thing. I, I guarantee, I guarantee there's a Rocket League manga. That would be, that would be really funny. <laughs> I'm uh, on, I'm on, I'm on chapter 346 right now. <laughs> I swear, after it's a slice of life anime after episode 542, <laughs> after the DMV arc, I swear it gets better. <laughs> it, the animation gets really good, guys. I, I swear. Um, but yeah, that was the first 3-0. This is a double header. Uh, so stick around for match two at nine o'clock where we'll take on St. Clair gold. They're currently seated first in the division. So we, we kind of swept St. Xavier. We'll see what happens. Absolutely. All right. Big win. Uh, yeah, we'll see you at nine.